All right, so I just finished receiving my 2013 American Eagle West Point two coin silver set, and I'm pretty excited um, and actually a little glad because it finally arrived here. Um, they pushed the date back uh, because they had like a back order issue or something like that, and I was actually supposed to receive it two weeks from now, but they sent it two weeks earlier, so I am a little pleased with that. Um, so we'll get right into it. Of course, you guys already know what a regular ASC looks like an American Silver Eagle with the highly polished, not highly polished, excuse me, highly frosty look. Um, this is a 2013 West Point, 2011. And I have yet to open this, so let's get right to it. Comes with this lovely box. Very nice soft cloth. And it's really slippery. This is very nice. I expected them to, to bring it in a in a little cheap uh, cardboard box, kind of like this. But it's a nice, I guess, wooden box, maybe plastic. I believe they're celebrating their 75th uh, anniversary for the United States Mint. I believe that's why they released this. And of course there's some literature in here. Um, as you're going to see, the left one is actually a reverse proof. And the right one is an enhanced circulation coin. Uncirculated, excuse me. And of course they give you the specifications. I'll talk about that as we go along. Comes with a, a nice display mat. I would assume this is a display mat. Very cool. Ooh, and there you have it. Let's see if we can get a better shot of that. Oh yeah, beautiful. All right, so according to their website, uh, the mintage limit or the or the amount they made or produced was exactly two hundred and eighty-one thousand three hundred and ten. So. Just under three hundred thousand of these were produced. Of course, the the front um, the front features the Adolf Weinmann's uh, design, the Walking Liberty, as you can see, with our famous uh, motto "In God We Trust." And of course, the back with the uh, John Mercanti's uh, eagle, holding the arrows and the olive branch. And wow, I must say, this is very very nice. So let's do a little quick comparison. Um, just like every other um, ASC, it's uh, the diameter is 1.5 inches. To be, uh, if you want to be precise, it's 1.598 inches. Uh, the thickness, uh, 0.12 inches. Nothing new here. This one does. Um, this is a West Point um, edition, so they did stamp the W on the back. Um, 
does have a very positive reads, I'm sure, just like the like all ASCs. So you can see this one. And I'm really enjoying this um this enhanced uncirculated version. As you can see, it has a highly frost surface on the front and the forward, just like just like this one. But it also has the high polish as well in the inside of her dress and in the flag. And it has a semi-proof um, field in the background. And it's the same thing on the other side. And I must say it is lovely. Now the reverse proof as you can see is obviously a reverse proof. I don't have a, a proof to, so, to show you. I don't have one in my collection just yet. But it does remind me a lot like of the, um, of the 2013 Canadian maple leaf excuse me with the snake preview basically that's what it reminds me of with that like rough textured field in the background as you can see although it's not as rough as the the maple leaf and boy is that beautiful And actually, we're not only celebrating the 75th anniversary of the U.S. Mint, we're also celebrating our Independence Day, because it is July 4th today. And, well, actually, it's July 5th, but what's this? There's no difference. Which I believe... Ah, uh, yeah. So I hope you enjoyed this um, quick little demonstration of the very nice 2013 American Eagle West Point 2 coin silver set. And this box is actually pretty beautiful as well. Let me show you that right there. Oh yeah. This is 1789. So again, again I hope you uh, enjoyed this quick little view. and. Uh, you can find some online. I mean, if you don't have one, then I doubt you'll be able to buy one on the, off the mint because they stopped selling these on the mint itself. But um, again, maybe you can find one on eBay. They are going quite pricey already. They're going close to $200. Um, but I hope you can get your hands on one of these. I hope, if you're a collector, you must. this is a definitely must have. Well, peace. Have a great day.